I'm so excited and happy to take you to Hermes with me to pick up the things that I ordered from long time ago as it took a while for my essay to track down everything for me and I will show you what I checked out, a few things that I tried it on and the different sections like ready to wear shoes and jewelry in Hermes San Francisco. I haven't been to Hermes for a while and it still looks so clean and chic. It's just that the stock and inventory is still low for many items even compared to how it was a few months ago. I have a question for you. What quota bags have you gotten this year so far? I have a few people and a friends message me told me that no more quota bags for the rest of the year according to some rumor. I did ask my essay this question and she mentioned that it's not true as they are still receiving shipment due to the lockdown happened and the inventory and a global shipping issue the u.s boutique has gotten less bags for sure compared to before it does sound that it is very difficult to get a quota bag at this moment especially if you have certain preference or requirement have you heard or feeling the same thing or you feel it's pretty easy for you this year leave me a comment down below to let me know. Either way, I'm really happy to pick up the things that I have ordered. That is why I always wanted to make sure that I do buy the things I love and enjoy regardless for the bag or not. If you watched my Hermes wishlist video or my luxury wishlist video, you may be able to guess what I have picked up. I was actually quite interested to check out a few ready to wear pieces this time. Unfortunately, they all don't have my size even i order no guarantee my essay would be able to hunt down the size for me but i still tried on some pieces in the big size here just to see how they look the first piece i tried on is the hermes short puffer coat the material is in the waterproof quilted cashmere and a hundred percent cashmere here it's big but I really like how it looks on me. There is a small piece of logo in the front is embossed with the lambskin. I love the color cuff and the bottom has the knit rib trim. It's a very warm jacket. It feels really nice designed. Besides the black one, there is also a beige version available. The jacket is currently retail for $4,725. For 5K, which one would you pick? A jacket or a jewelry piece from Hermes? It was definitely jewelry for me before, but ever since I got my Hermes dress from my sister-in-law as a gift, I'm more open to their ready-to-wear and I get the beautiful of some of the ready-to-wear pieces here. They are low-key and a lot of times you can't even tell that they are Hermes ready-to-wear but it matters how they can make you feel. I also tried on this quilted puffer coat in black. This one I'm wearing is in size 40. You can see how big it's on me. Nice thing is that it has a waist belt to make it look more flattering. It has two front pockets with snap closure. It also has the ribbed collar and the cuffs. The puffer is actually more affordable than I would have expected. It's currently retail for $3,525. What do you think? They also have another puffer in beige color and it's also double-sided. The beige one is retail for $4,600. So which one do you like better? I would probably pick the black in this case. On to the shoe section, it seems there are a lot of shoes here but if you have a popular shoe size like me, 36 or 37, then chances are it's not easy to find your size in popular styles. I have to admit that I really love Hermes shoes especially when it comes to some of the styles. What's funny is that I also realized that I really love their white shoes for some reason as I just picked up two pairs and they're all in white and I will show you what I bought in my upcoming Hermes haul video for now I'm also really interested in getting a few other pairs one pair has been on my mind for a while is the classic neon ankle boots it's in the black color iconic Kelly buckle and a calf skin this pair is true to size it's also available in other colors however the second I tried it on I realized that 
this pair is not my style. Sometimes just because you love something or they're a classic, they don't necessarily suit you. What do you think? The other pair I'm also really interested in is these veal ankle boots. It's in the suede calf skin and the wool skin. It feels so comfy and warm inside. These veal ankle boots are currently retail for $1,850 and the classic neon ankle boots are retail for $1,475. I feel these veal boots are really nice but they're just too casual for my style. What do you think? I also got to try these white dusting loafers in calfskin with the classic Kelly buckle. This pair runs way too big. I am a size 36. This pair is 35 and a half and is still too big on me. What do you think of them? Onto the jewelry section here, they have some Constance and Kelly necklace with diamonds at this moment. And definitely quite some watches here. Deep down, I prefer my Rolex way more than Hermes watches, but I might be open to pick up a small size like 29mm and a really simple style Cape Cod watch in the future without any diamonds. What do you think of Hermes? watches. I feel like I have seen some of the jewelry pieces when I was here last time. I'm not too crazy about silver jewelry overall and I much more prefer Hermes' gold jewelry. How about you? Do you see these paved diamond bracelet? Usually the whole diamond paved ones are around 40,000. Besides the CDC bracelets here, they also have some Kelly bracelets in different diamonds versions. I finally got a chance to try on the diamond paved CDC bracelet with 476 diamonds. It's currently retail for $48,600. The half diamond Kelly bracelet in white gold and set with 61 diamonds is currently retail for $15,700. Which one do you like better? The whole diamond or the half diamond. Either one, your dream bag will for sure come faster than you expected. Certain home goods are still low in stock because I was also interested in getting something it's also not available. There are tons of fashion jewelry and also small leather goods are available if you're looking for some. I hope you enjoyed these eye candies. Leave me a comment down below to let me know what quota bags you have gotten this year and what's next on your wish list. I would love to hear from you. Stay tuned for my Hermes haul unboxing video and I'll see you soon. Bye bye!